Hi, I'm Dr. Who and you're watching my channel. So last time I said I was going to play a whole lot because I had time to do so. Um, I didn't have time to do so, but I have a little bit of time now and I've been jonesing to play. I've got a little bit of time, a little window, and so I'm gonna play. I can definitely shank a motherfucker in the 40 minutes that I have. So let's play. Assassin's Creed. All right, last time we marked uh, uh, Mujahideen, the scumbag who was just like, I like, I, I kill people because it's fun, bitch. I don't have a higher purpose. I just want power, my guy. Use throwing knives to deal with distant enemies. And that was pretty good a little frustrating um but i like that he was he was the first of them to like actually fight back instead of just running away um and now uh who is next altair it seems my students do not fully understand what it means to wield, wield a blade. blade perhaps you could show them what you know um, next up is either oh god I need to remember how to play <laughs> alright great yeah I am don't have time for this man You must be busy. I understand. It takes time to draw another blade. What is your first attack? So next we have um yeah yeah yeah. Uh I think it's either William and Monfra at Acre or Ab Ab Damascus. Uh let's go to Acre. Should you enter a fist fight, guards will not interfere, but drawing your weapon will turn them hostile. Rafiq, word has spread of your deeds, Altair. It seems you are sincere in your desire to redeem yourself. I do what I can. And sometimes you do it well. I assume it is work that reunites us? Yes. William of Montferrat is my target. What can you tell me of the man himself? William has been named regent while the king conducts his war. The people see it as a strange choice given the history between Richard and William's son, Conrad. But I think Richard rather clever for it. Clever how? Richard and Conrad do not see eye to eye on most matters. Though they are civil enough in public, there are whispers that each intends evil upon the other. And then, there was that business with Akkar's captured Saracens. In its way, Conrad has returned to Tyre, and Richard has compelled William to remain here as his guest. You mean his hostage? Whatever you wish to call it, William's presence here should dissuade Conrad from acting out. I've never been one for politics. But surely you realize your every action shapes the course of this land's future. You are a politician too, in your own way. As you wish. Now where would you suggest I begin my search? Richard's citadel, southwest of here. Or rather, the market in front of it. You'll find the Cathedral of the Holy Cross in that direction as well. It's a popular place and should be filled with talkative citizens. Finally, try the border to the west, where the chain and hospitaller districts meet. That should start you on your way. Very well. I won't disturb you further. It's no trouble at all. He's gonna hurt himself, and when he does, I won't help him.
Hmm? Hello down there. This place is restricted. Well, Be good gone. thing I'm not here. God, Acre just looks so unpleasant. Oh, fuck off. I will die for bumping into you. Oh, come on, man. Easy. Forget this. I've better things this to do than look for vermin. Okay. Not here. Can't prove it. Die, thief. That hurts. Stop it, please. You dirty thief. I'll have your hands for that. Stop it, please. You're hurting me. Die, thief. Thief. This will teach you not to steal. Easy. Hello, ma'am. They did not say what they wanted from me, but I saw the darkness in their eyes. I'm sorry, I have nothing to offer in return for your sacrifice, but I shall see to it that my brothers know you are a friend. Alright. Oh, Jesus, relax. It's just a dead body. To be here. Leave. Oh come on, dude! Don't do it! 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 See ya. What's wrong? Oh God! Don't kill me! Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Exact. I was trying to strike a deal with them, but I realized that they were toying with me, so I ran away. You shall be the angel of death and collect their heads before they collect mine. When it is done, I shall tell you of the deal. I'll have your hands for that. Oh God! Don't kill me. Uh -oh. When is he going to stop this nonsense? Oh my god. Oh my god, why are there so many drunks? Went the wrong way. I am really taking the scenic route here. 
Okay. Oh my god. The crossover here, please. Stop it, please! You're hurting me! Oh my god. Okay. I'll have your hands for that. What have I done wrong? Tell me, please. What have I done wrong? Tell me, please. Please. You dare steal in my presence. Double cost you your life. Uh, I'm wait, so what? How is he? Oh, is it the Templar? Okay. I guess he's not a Templar, he just looks like one. I feel like I tried throwing knives before and it fucked me. I'm gonna not do that. Your mother. Why are the drunks growling? Mm -hmm. Thank you, Master. I got you. I tried to make a deal with the Citadel guards to leave the gates open even when the alarm sounds. I failed you. So now, your only escape from Richard's Citadel will be to climb the fortress walls. Forgive me. Oof. Throw rocks at me? Oh, hello, friend. Bye. What the fuck? No shot. <laughs> what? I mean, he can't get up here, right? You have to climb up here. Where'd he go? 
That's crazy. Not make things easier. Easy. They let you come and go as you please. Oh wow. I thought the fortress was closed to all. Aye, but William wishes to have repairs completed as soon as possible. It's been to our advantage. The perfect cover. It's clever. Anyway, I finished my report and should deliver it. For once, it seems things might go our way, and not by accident. Well, the Bible does say God helps those who help themselves. Nah, it doesn't actually. That's from one of Aesop's fables. The Bible says quite the opposite, in fact. Many passages of being patient and faithful and waiting for the Lord to decide if he wishes to assist. Well, I say we've waited <laughs> long enough. You'll hear no argument from me. Very well. I'm off then. Who did this? He really hit him with the, he really hit him with the um, actually, medieval style. My knee. Man, who could have taken it? There's only three people here. That's so silly. Jesus. God help me! He's a thief! What? I'll have your hands for that! You bitch! This is awkward. <laughs> these windows is that 
You just climb these. I feel like it's I feel like it's gonna be more complicated than that. Oh okay, Altair. Yeah, I didn't think so. Fuck off, dude. I'm so confused. William of Montferrat had a vision. So a way to end our pain. It's him we should follow. It's him will lead us to victory. Okay. We are too soft with our enemies. With one hand we engage them, but the other tries to embrace. What good could come of this when our king can it decide what he truly wants? But William knows. Where am I supposed to be going here? to end our pain it's him we should follow it's him will lead us to victory we are too soft with our enemies with one hand we engage them my grandma the tries to embrace what there we go come of this when our king can it decide what he truly wants but william knows if you would <laughs> only listen and what do we have to show for it graves and widows and orphaned sons king richard promises a better morrow Unspoiled land and new beginnings, but he delivered only death. William of Montferrat had a vision. It's all way to end our pain. It's him we should. Oh, come on, let me go around this, please. Uh, this is annoying. This is frustrating. Widows and orphaned sons. King Richard promises a bad morrow. Unspoiled land and new beginnings, but he delivered only death. I was just here. I can't. I can't go back around. What? Hello, Altair. What? Uh, uh. What the hell? Are you serious? You came around this corner. <laughs> like what? Am, what am I missing? And what do we have to show for it? Graves and widows and orphaned sons. King Richard like, why would they allow you to climb this far up, but it not be the way up? Or a way up? William of Montferrat had a vision. It's all way to end our pain. It's him we should follow. It's him will lead us to victory. Did he just run into that person? Harrison's are routed at every turn. We cast them out of the and ask them from the countryside. I can't climb any of these windows.
Dear God. Ugh. That took so long. You have no business yet. Leave. What the hell? Damn, this is tall. Oh my god. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> What's here? Oh my god. Jump backwards and say, hey, let's find out. No, you can't. Oh, no. Oh, no. I hit, <laughs> I hit the water under the map. Oh, whatever. That's fine. It's a fast way down. But the other tries to embrace. What good could come of this when a king take yourself from here before I call the guard? Sorry, sir, don't mind me. Too soft with our enemies. With one hand we engage them, but the other tries to embrace. What good could come of this when our king cannot decide what he truly wants? But William knows. If you would only listen. You would only listen. Stand up, friends. Do not allow yourself to be sent to slaughter based on the whims and wishes of an uncertain king. We must rely on men who are stronger in their convictions. Men like William of Montferrat. Oh man, you don't even know you're about to catch these hands, brother. Guards around. <laughs> Easy. Stop. Enough. Enough. What is it you want? Gold? Have a few pieces on me. Take them. Take them and go. It's not gold I seek, but information. I know nothing. You know William. Tell me how to reach him. It's impossible. He meets with the king. And when will the king be gone? Today. But it won't help you. They're sure to argue. And then William will retire to lecture the soldiers. So it always goes. Richard berates William. William berates his men. He won't see you. I already told you. I need to see William. I never said he needs to see me. Then our business is done. Not yet, I'm afraid. There's one last thing I need from you. What is it? Your life. Uh out there, we're in the middle of the street. <laughs> My God. Out there, that was unhinged. You're going to get caught. <laughs> How much time do I have? Oh, I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. No time for planning. Oh no. Oh no. 
<laughs> All right, maybe a little bit of planning. <laughs> Just enough planning to not jump off of rooftops. But like past that, no planning. Not, not enough time. What the hell? I'll tell you. Stop. You must not trespass here. Hm. What is it? Altair, what brings you back so soon? I've done as asked and armed myself with knowledge. Speak, and I will judge. William's host is large, and many men call him master. But he's not without enemies. He and King Richard do not see eye to eye. It's true, they've never been close. This works to my advantage. Richard's visit has upset him. Once the king has left, William will retreat into his fortress to brood. He'll be distracted. That's when I will strike. You're sure of this? As sure as I can be. And if things change, I'll adapt. Then I give you leave to go. End the life of Montferrat that we may call this city free. Let's go. I'll return when the deed's been done. Fast forward in memory to a more recent one. Strike after William meets with Richard, he'll be distracted by his meeting. Yeah, I wanted you to jump, but not straight up into the air, buddy. Yeah, totally what I meant to do. Flawless, honestly. Where the hell? Die, thief! Dead end. There are reasons to do that. Help me! You dare steal in my presence? That will cost you your life. Not trespass here. <laughs> Perfect. Cool. Three thousand souls, William. I was told they would be held as prisoners and used to barter for the release of our men. The Saracens would not have honored that end of the bargain. You know this to be true. I did you a favor. <laughs> Oh, yes. A great favor indeed. Now our enemies will be that much stronger in their convictions. Fight that much harder. I know our enemy well. They will not be emboldened, but filled with fear. Tell me, how is it you know the intentions of our enemies so well? You forsake the field of battle to play politics. 
I did what Spicy. was right, what was just. You swore an oath to uphold the work of God, William. But that is not what I see here. No, I see a man who's trampled it. Your words are most unkind, my liege. I would hope I might have earned your trust by now. You are Arca's regent, William, set to rule in my stead. How much more trust is required? Perhaps you'd like my crown. You missed the point. <laughs> but this is nothing new. Much as I'd like to waste my day trading words with you. I, well, I can't believe this an argument like this is happening this so time. publicly. Do not let me delay you then, your grace. I fear there will be no place for men like him in the new world. Send word that I wish to speak with the troops. We must ensure and I can't believe he just said that out loud. <laughs> Warn them that any negligence will be severely punished. I'm in no mood to be trifled with today. Yes, my lord. The rest of you, follow me. That was not very nice. Damn fool must be out of his mind. <sighs> Let's go. We are speed running this. Or not. Because they gave me a thing to climb and then nowhere else to go. Oh my god. Why? Why is this game like this? Oh, I'm just dumb. It's fine. fine i'm stupid all right here we go here we go here we go satellite radio don't mind me just passing through That's a lot. Okay. Um, shit. I come from speaking with the king, and the news is grim. We stand accused of failing in our duties. He does not recognize the value of our contributions to the cause. For shame! He knows nothing! Peace! Peace! Hold your tongue. Aye, he speaks falsely, but his words are not without some merit. To tour these grounds, it is easy to find fault, to see imperfection. I fear we have grown slack and lazy. Never! We are committed! Why do you say this? I see the way you train. Why do you say this? Focus, you gossip and gamble. Tasks set to you are left unfulfilled or poorly performed. This ends today. I will not suffer further degradation at his hands. For whether or not you see it, and you should, this is your fault. You've brought shame upon us all. Skill and dedication are what won us, Ark, and they will be required to keep it. I have been too lenient, it seems, but no more. You will train harder and more often. If this means missing meals, missing sleep, so be it. And should you fail in these tasks, you will learn the true meaning of discipline. Bring them forward. If I must make examples of some of you to ensure obedience, so be it. Mm. Two of you stand accused of whoring and drinking while on duty. What say you to these charges? My, 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 my lord, please. We, we, we meant no harm by it. We, we forgot ourselves. It will not happen again. No. It was. <laughs> this regard Jeez. is infectious. It shall be rooted out and destroyed. In this way, we may prevent its spread. And that is some Am Templar shit destroyed? there. Yes, my lord. Of course, by your command. Good, good. Return to your posts filled with a new sense of purpose. Stay strong, stay focused, and we will triumph. Falter, however. And you will join these men. Be sure of it. Dismissed.
Damn. That's fucked up. Hello, sir. Rest now. Your schemes are at an end. What do you know of my work? I know that you are going to murder Richard and claim Akka for your son Conrad. <laughs> for Conrad? My son is an arse, unfit to lead his host, let alone a kingdom. And Richard, the Oncino is no better, blinded as he is by faith in the insubstantial. Akra does not belong to either of them. Then who? The city belongs to its people. How can you claim to speak for the citizens? You stole their food, disciplined them without mercy, forced them into service under you. Everything I did, I did to prepare them for the new world. Stole their food? No. I took possession so that when the lean times came, it might be rationed properly. <coughs> Look around. My district is without crime, save those committed by you and your ilk. And as for the conscription, they were not being trained to fight. They were being taught the merits of order and discipline. These things are hardly evil. No matter how noble you believe your intentions, these acts are cruel and cannot continue. <laughs> we'll see how sweet they are, the fruits of your labors. You do not free the cities as you believe, but rather damn them. And in the end, you'll have only yourself to blame. You, who speak of good intentions. How did y'all know that happened? He didn't even know that happened. No, no, no rocks! See ya, bitches. I'm outie. Assassin, where? Yeah, dude, I feel done for. Except a gnaw. Oh, Altair, Altair, what is your aim? All right, fine. You get away. I don't care. Oh, oh my God. Bye. That not kill him. Hide in the box. <laughs> He's having fun. Look at him go. <laughs>
What news? William of Montferrat is dead, and with him his plans for betrayal. You've done well keeping Akka from his hands. But why now, when the Crusaders require unity most? Could have waited. Waited for what? For Richard to return and discover his schemes? No. It was the perfect time for him to strike. Strange. I was sure he meant to take Akka for Conrad, yet he claimed this was not his plan. You cannot trust the words of a snake, which even in death produces venom. I should discuss this mm. with Al-Muallim. Yes, my friend. Make haste for Masia. I am sure he is eager for news. Okay. Fast forward in memory to a more recent one. When the Animus shows you are being watched by an informed guard, you should blend immediately. Even the slightest disturbance will attract. Come, Altair. I would have news of your progress. I've done as you've asked. Good. Good. I sense your Good. thoughts are elsewhere. Good. Speak your mind. Each man I'm sent to kill speaks cryptic words to me. Each time I come to you and ask for answers. Each time you give only riddles in exchange, but no more. Sounds a little testy. Who are you to say no more? I'm the one who does the killing. If you want it to continue, you'll speak straight with me for once. Oh, fiery. I do not like your tone. And I do not like your deception. Give it to him. I have offered you a chance to restore your lost honor. Not lost. Taken. By <laughs> you. And then you've sent me to fetch it again like some damn dog. Oh my god. <laughs> I'll need to find another. A shame. You showed great potential. I think if you had another, you'd have sent him long ago. You said the answer to my question would arise when I no longer needed to ask it. So I will not ask. I demand you tell me what binds these men. Oh my god. Altair. What you say is true. These men are connected by a blood oath not unlike our own. Who are they? Non nobis, domine non nobis. Templars. Now you see the true reach of Robert de Sable. All of these men, leaders of cities, commanders of armies, all pledge allegiance to his cause. Their works are not meant to be viewed on their own, are they? But as a whole, what do they desire? Conquest. They seek the Holy Land not in the name of God, but for themselves. What of Richard, Salah Eddin? Any who oppose the Templars will be destroyed. Be assured they have the means to accomplish it. Then they must be stopped. That is why we do our work, Altair. To ensure a future free of such things. Why did you hide the truth from me? That you might pierce the veil yourself. Like any task, knowledge precedes action. Information learned is more valuable than information given. That's true. Besides, your recent behavior had not inspired much confidence. Also true. I see. Altair, your mission has not changed. Merely the context within which you perceive it. And armed with this knowledge, I might better understand those Templars that remain. Is there anything else you want to know? What about the treasure Malik retrieved from Solomon's temple? Robert seemed desperate to have it back. In time, Altair, all will become clear. Just as the role of the Templars has revealed itself to you, so too will the nature of their treasure. For now, take comfort in the fact that it is not in their hands, but ours. If this is your desire. It is. You are restored another rank. Take back your weapon. Use it to bring honor to the Brotherhood. Altair, before you go... Yes? How did you know I wouldn't kill you? Truth be told, Master, I didn't. I took a leap of faith. <laughs> I'll tell you, it was kind of cool there. New weapon gained, extra throwing knives. You can practice in the courtyard. Okay. 
Fantastic. I knew I could do it in the amount of time I had. <laughs> Always believe in yourself. Okay, so we murked William and Montferrat in like what 40 minutes? Is it 40 minutes? A little more than 40 minutes? 50 minutes. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. I still got time. Alright. I don't have time to hang around and talk though. So this is good. Uh I will probably be making another one very soon. And uh have a good day. Good life. Thanks for watching. Leave a like, comment, whatever you want, and uh, maybe I'll see you again.